This is Film Masters. On this episode, we're recreating the Death Trooper's voice from Rogue One. It's going to sound like this. Okay, we're in Adobe's audition, and the first thing we're gonna do is gonna go up to waveform, and I'm gonna call this Death Trooper. I'm gonna leave the sample rate as 44100, channels as stereo, and bit rate at 32 floating, select OK. Once we've done that, the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do a voiceover. Now, one thing about the Death Troopers is when you hear them talking, they're actually not aliens, they're not robots, they're elite troops and they're actually scrambling their communications to each other so you hear that uh, broken up sounds and even though it comes across as if they're talking a different language they're actually not it's just a scrambled signal so whatever we say in this recording will be scrambled so in the movie itself as you remember they're looking for Jin Erso when she's a child at the very beginning so we're going to use some of that dialogue and we're going to do a recording now so I'm just going to come down here and press the record button Look to the left. Search for the child. The child is located in the hut. Okay, so I'm just going to play that back. Look to the left. Search for the child. The child is located in the hut. So once I've done that recording, I'm going to make sure that I select the waveforms that I want to modify. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to Effects and come down to Special and select the Dupler Shifter. So once I've done that, I'm going to come to the presets and drop that down to Drippy. And now we're going to make some changes here to the values. I'm going to make the Radius 2 and the Velocity 350. The starting angle will be 19 and the center in front by, I want to make that 8. Once I've done that, I'm going to select OK, and it will sound like this. Now, once I've done that, there's only one more step to do, and it's up to favorites, and it's simply remove vocals. So once I remove the vocals, we'll have the end sound sounding like this. So now all I have to do is go up to File, Save As, Death Trooper, Wave is going to be our file name. We're going to find the location. I'm just going to put it onto the desktop, select Save, and select OK, and we're done. So that's how you do the Death Trooper's voice in Adobe's audition. Now, if you're a part of the 501st, um, obviously, you can make up your own words or your own uh, sayings and record them and put them into a recorder if you're dressing up um, in your Star Wars uh, Rogue One costumes. Otherwise, if you're doing a short film or even uh, using Lego or, for example, um, the six-inch figures and you're making your own little stop-go animation short film, then this is another way of using your own voice to make a Death Trooper voice. And that is how we recreate the Death Trooper voice from... Star Wars Rogue One. If you want to become a Film Master subby, it's pretty simple. Just subscribe to the channel. You can like us on Facebook and or on Twitter. And until next time, don't just film it, master it.